the long-awaited Bertol. I'm gonna start with my favorite pieces. So I found this blazer set and like, I mean, even the red lining, like it makes such a difference. It's actually wool. Like this is like wool. It's good quality, like the way that they like used to make clothes back in the day. And it came with this skirt. I like, I'm not super big on the pleats here. I honestly kind of like how the back looks better, but I'm not sure if I would wear the back as the front, but I, it was actually like a midi. And then I actually cropped it to be a mini mini. Cause you know how I feel like I like a really, really mini skirt, but I just feel like this is so cute. I wore the skirt to the rehearsal dinner for the wedding that I just went to. I'm obsessed. It has the shoulder pads in and normally I take the shoulder pads out, but I don't have the heart in me to take the shoulder pads out this time because it's such a well-made blazer, but so cute, obsessed. I found three dresses from Princess Polly. I'm so excited for someone donated like all their new Princess Polly stuff. A V-neck dress, and then it's like a mesh overlay, and then it has like kind of, I don't know what material this is at the bottom. Just like a really soft, stretchy material, and you could, I'm tall enough. You could see the mesh on the bottom. I think it's such like a cute detail. I'm obsessed. I've already worn this to the office one time and it's just such an easy dress just to slip on. Okay, I have it tied. This one, it's another v-neck dress and I don't even really like v-neck dresses that much, but this one is a v-neck and it's maxi. It goes all the way down to the floor. It has like this like floral detail on it. It's really cute. It's also Christmas time. I'm like midway through wrapping like some gifts. Anyway, I need, oh my gosh, I need to hem this one still because it is super long because I'm really short. So I have it just tied to hang up so it doesn't like interfere with a lot of stuff, but so cute, little floral sign, really pretty. Oh wait, I have four dresses from Princess Polly, but they were from the thrift store. This one, can you see this? It like, is kind of like lace. It's like really, and it has like this like bodice portion and then the small like boob portion. I really like this dress. You could tell why this dress was donated because this, it's like this part, like the most outer part of the strip strap is tighter than the inner part so it like wants to fall off your shoulder so whenever i wear this it's falling off my shoulder the whole time but it's actually a really great length and i really like it it's like just a really cute basic dress very hard about this very very cute i'm just making a mess of my room you know this dress also from princess probably i don't know how i feel about it because i am short and the torso it's like a low torso and it comes into a v here i do like the v i think because i'm so short the low torso doesn't look great on me also the boobs i mean they're just like huge i mean what do you know this is a size two which is a size too big so it's like a little bit loose on me but the boobs are huge i'm like who's a size two with just massive tits like clearly not i it has like the flare at the bottom it's a really cute like concept i really do like how this one looks but i just don't know if i'm into the whole drop waist thing the boobs are too big it's really soft too. I'm just getting tired. I really do like this dress, but I don't know. I just don't see myself like wearing it. I was like, maybe I could do something with it. I don't know if I will end up doing something with it, but maybe. Who knows? Okay, 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 okay. I have three more things that I thrifted. Just some coats. And you guys have seen these because this is a cumulative haul, so I've been waiting to show you these things. So you guys have seen these things. Next two coats. A lot, actually. I have this black coat from Ann Taylor that I thrifted. Has shoulder pads. I haven't taken them out because the construction is so good. It like, I don't have the heart in me to remove things from it. Yeah, also one of the buttons here is gone so it kind of just dangles which like it's a great detail i'm not mad about it um it's a double breasted it's so cute it's such like a good staple coat it's like warmer than the next one i'm going to show you which i can appreciate because some coats like are just trenches they're just made for the rain but you know when it rains it's not not cold it's like cold still so cute i'm obsessed it's like things were like clothes this item is an example of how clothes were so were much better made back in the day and i love it i'm obsessed i wear it all the time to the office so comfy you guys have seen this from honestly like a while back that's how long i've been waiting to show you these things it's just it's kind of like the same design it's like a double breasted but it's brown and it's from banana republic obviously thrifted so cute i think like this cool brown color is not gonna go out of style like a warm brown is gonna go out of style but this cool brown is like almost never gonna go out of style i'm like honestly obsessed with this i think it's better for when i'm wearing clothes that are like white like this because it's not as contrasty between the, the white and this as it would be with like a black yeah because when i'm wearing white i don't want it to be like on the verge of color blocking wearing a black coat i want to be wearing like something a little bit softer which is just barely any softer but it makes a big difference i'm obsessed with this it's so cute it comes with the tie the same way the other one did like i said this is not warm at all but you know for the fashion and then i have not even worn this yet i have like a light tan one with a hood which i love actually like a pretty big hood too this is from london fog yeah it has like so many pockets it's kind of like pretty industrial really really kind of like a classic trench type of jacket i mean it's really cute i just haven't worn it yet i haven't really had a reason to wear it i mean like it was raining a few days ago so i could have worn that but i do prioritize those other two coats because they're really cute but i need to wear this soon nice light tan color it has the same like arm cuff things which i can appreciate and 
And yeah, big hood, which I like. The last two of my thrifted things I have not even worn because I'm not sure about them, honestly. So I got a pair of Ann Taylor Petite Low Rise Curvy. Like, I can never tell if these are dark brown or if these are black. And to this day, I still don't know. It's like broad daylight right now and I'm really not sure still. But I should go this way. This is my better side. But yeah, these are like low-waisted. I've shown these in videos like a few times just to exemplify them, but they're a little long and I haven't cropped them yet. So I need to fix them up first of all. But I just don't know, like low rise, it's like cute, but you know, it does make me look shorter because I'm so short. And I just, I just I have no idea what color this is. Like it's like kind of right in between black and brown. Very subtle, but I got these, literally haven't worn them. Still have the tie on. They're curvy though, but they fit well even too. But you know, I don't know. Sometimes you just buy things and they're just a flaw. Like I bought two other princess poly dresses from that same thrift store that i went to to get those for because the fitting room wasn't open so i couldn't try them on they didn't end up fitting so i sold them on my depop okay these jeans these are like i don't know they're from bcg bdg which is why i got them they're the urban outfitters brand and i like the two-tone i think they have a lot of personality they are a little big on the waist for me they're 25 i am not 25 waist they're good material like normal and they're cropped they're like really short. They're like not really short, but like they're right at the ankle. So you could see a little bit of my like leg above my shoe if I'm wearing like a low shoe. They're really good material, which is really the reason I got them. And you know, when you get things from the store, they're like so cheap. So you're just like, I'm just gonna get it. So I just got it, but I don't know. I mean, like I could in the summer just wear it with this, just with the plain top and just, you know, chill. Good quality, look at all like, they look so short when I'm showing you them. I don't know, they're good quality, I like them, but I just haven't worn them yet. Maybe it's just like not the season, you know. I'm gonna switch over to shoes because I got these and they're really cute. They're just, they're really used. Normally the shoes that I get aren't like that used, but these are really used. And they're like, I don't know what size these are. Okay, they don't have a size on them, so that's really helpful. And these are just like a little big, so I have these inserts in them. And at first I was putting these inserts like in the back here. Someone gave me these inserts, so clearly I didn't know how they worked. I was putting them back here and I was like, oh, this is not really working, like helping a little bit my foot is still popping out and then they were like you're supposed to put it in your toe so then i put it there and oh my gosh game changing like they're tight now i wore these with crew socks and that black dress not that long ago when i thought it was so cute so i'm obsessed just a very classic style it has like some lighter stitching here which i'm not like a super big fan of but it's like i'm just finding things to be picky about you know but anyway so cute obsessed anyway that's all the stuff that i thrifted and i'm gonna show you stuff that i bought recently show you things that i've bought recently just for fun because i like to add a little bit more into these holes so have a few things okay so i bought yeah i don't know if you could really see that i bought two pairs okay i'm gonna show you this i bought one in white okay and then this is the same one this one will show up better on camera of trousers and i don't know exactly how to feel about them i did crop them and it is too late to return them because as soon as i got them i tried them on and i wasn't sure about them and then i just left them for like half of a month and then i cropped them and then i wore this one i did wear this one to the office and like my stitching was like really good like the matches so well but i don't know how to feel because this waistband here these are from love bonito both of these the waistband here is really thick do you see how thick that is and like i am short right i always talk about this i am short and i have like a normal sized torso and like normal sized legs i think i'm like pretty balanced in the way that my body is just like given to me but this wide waistband it makes my torso look a little shorter because it brings the waistband so high up so i'm really not sure but they are constructed pretty well but they are fully polyester which i don't love but yeah and they're like but they're like 50 bucks so you know i don't know it's like everything's made out of polyester and it's like unless you're gonna spend like a hundred on a pair of trousers and, it, and i just needed light trousers and i needed white trousers so i got the white pair too these ones i'm even more uncertain about because you could see the back pockets on the back and like i was wearing like normally this is so tmi normally i wear normally i wear a thong just like on an everyday occasion i'm just a thong wear i think they're more comfortable than just regular underwear but i was wearing regular underwear because i was on my period at home and i was trying these on such a great idea first of all to wear to be on my period and try on white pants but you know semantic and you could see my whole underwear out which is what the review said as well but i was like oh it's gonna be fine because they upgraded these pairs i don't know whatever i already have them they're cute just gotta wear a thong with them that's the only thing they're from love bonita which i like that brand but a lot of their stuff is polyester which is really sad which is cheaper you know i don't know whatever i'm trying okay yeah this one's cotton cool so i got a vest you guys have seen this in one of my other videos i believe um i'm obsessed it's so fun honestly like it's so wrinkly but i got a vest it has like these like linen like buttons too which i like and then what i really like is that it cinches in the back because i could tell that this isn't constructed super well this is from, from princess polly sorry did i say that these next two things this one and the next one are from princess polly it's not constructed super well because i do find myself like pulling the front down like this multiple times a day which i clearly hate but you know what can you do i didn't want to return it because i do really like the fit of it otherwise i like how low it drops i like the cinch in the back it's pretty much perfect except for the fact that it's 
it's like like i don't even know why that happens and why in constructing this item that happens but it happens that sucks but you know what can you do i love that piece I wear it all the time i would wear it more if i could i mean i could but like i shouldn't because I just wear it too often next item from princess polly also i think this one is fully polyester polyester unfortunately recycled polyester whatever that means i have to take this off of the hanger to show you but i got let me button this up i got a two-piece set and i this is my first two-piece set it's like it has more buttons but i didn't button them up i wore this to the wedding to the reception so cute i like how it like separates here and then i don't button this one because i have a shorter torso than the girl that models this clearly so her torso wouldn't need this button but my torso does not and it like is super tight right here because i got a really fitted size and then it kind of like flares out because this is on bun and it gives you such a snatch waist look it's so cute i'm like really obsessed i think this gray color looks great on my skin tone because my skin tone does veer like a little bit gray so cute and matching trousers i did have to hem these which i hate but you know that's just what happens when you're short but look at that stitching i feel like i did a really great job on these honestly like, these are like really good this is, like 10 p.m these look so good like they make the booty pop i like how there's no pockets on the back side and just has the pleating so it like lays really close to your waist it's so cute i'm like literally so obsessed sitting in the front so cute i like i just think gray is like one of those colors that look really great i'm so excited about that i want to wear it more I feel like that's like just a summer night type of piece where i'm wearing it like and just wearing that i'm gonna style it soon in a video for you guys um coming up and this is my entire haul of all the things i've thrifted and all the things that i've bought the thrift stores have been kind of dry recently but i'm trying to get back and thrift some more i like got a lot of that stuff when i was thrifting for the wedding in like the pasadena area because like i said in my vlog like they have really good thrifting there this is my whole haul i hope you enjoyed if you did make sure to leave a like and subscribe because then i know i'm making that contact for you guys and making things that you want to see and that you like um and if you have any suggestions of what you want to see from me please leave them down below i just want to take your suggestions see what you guys want to see from me so if you have any suggestions leave them down below and i will see you guys in a few weeks in my next video so i will see you then